Hello, my lovelies. So this should be vlog number hmm, nine, right? Yes, I'm kind of filming things out of order. So, haha. -ha, um, <laughs> this should be vlog nine. Um, I uh, I had a couple of uh, questions about: Are you ever going to show any more of your mail? Um, and I thought, well, I went and picked up stuff from the box today, so. Let's open it, I guess. Um, I pre-opened some of it, and then I thought, oh, hmm, they might want to actually see, you know, my expression or whatever when I open things. So, um, yeah, but let's do the letters first, um, which I have not opened all of them yet, but I like to sit down and read those later. But I did get a um, postcard from Paris. Uh one of my girls was there, and she said all of the glitz, uh, she got to visit the Arc de Triumph and see the light show in the Eiffel Tower, and it reminded her of me, which is awesome. But, yeah, so I got from the uh, from Paris. I got a postcard from Paris. I have never been. I have never been anywhere but Canada. I mean, as, like, far as out of the country, and you didn't have to have a passport back then. Hmm, old. Um... So, yay, I got a postcard from Paris. I got um, I got letters from Mallory in Ohio, Kimberly in Minnesota, Lindsay in Rhode Island. Oh, Lindsay, congratulations. You just had your baby. Um, and she's beautiful. So, congratulations, Lindsay. Um, I feel like I've been waiting forever for you to have that baby. I know. It's only been nine months. <laughs> um, I got another letter from Miss Kim in Indiana. Um, Kim is very good at correspondence, and uh, she has fast become one of my go-to girls on Facebook. Um, Miss Bethany in Kansas. I'm telling you, I am huge in Kansas. And Miss Kathleen in Florida. This feels kind of thick. I'm going to open this, Kathleen. I want to see what's in here. Mm. my trusting paring knife. I really should get like some sort of fancy letter opener. You know, I've actually been looking for a letter opener that's shaped like a sword. Um, I know it's sword. I know. I like to say sword because there's a W in there. Just like any word that has a K-N, like knife, knob, knight. I say knight, knob, knife. Well, I don't, silent K just doesn't make any sense to me. So, any hoodles. Oh, my gosh. Can I get this thing open? Good tape, girl. My gosh, that's some good tape. Mm, ha. The tape did not defeat me. Oh, and it's stuck to, you did not want anybody getting in this. Now, is there some sort of, oh, I ripped. I'm telling you, I have got to get a real letter opener. Urgh. Yes, I am that kid on Christmas that ripped all her paper. I could never get it out in a timely, fat, in a nice, neat, you know, save the paper. for. Oh, my gosh, there's all kinds of stuff in here. Okay, let's see it, shall we? Oh, that's so pretty. Do you make your own cards? You make your own cards. This is homemade. Oh, my gosh, look at this. Talent, talent, it's backwards, I'm sorry. <laughs> you guys know I have to keep it mirrored or otherwise I'm doing this constantly trying to figure out where I am in the frame. Look at how beautiful that is. Oh my good, oh, oh, stencils. You sent me stencils, I love stencils. I love stencils. Oh look, see, I can hold this up backwards and it's forward. Look at how nice. Oh. oh, sparkly leaves. Oh, fabulous witch hats. Sparkly pumpkins. Oh my gosh, this is so nice. Thank you. Oh my gosh. Kathleen, thank you. <laughs> you scrapbook, don't you? I'll bet you scrapbook and make your own cards and, well, clearly you make your own cards. Hello. That is so nice. Gosh, it's so pretty. Oh, 
I love all this stuff. Um, I probably shouldn't sing. I really apologize for what just happened there. Um, now you know why they don't really let me sing in the band much. <laughs> oh, that was so cool. Okay, let's see. What's next? All right, I got a package from Wisconsin. I have a brother that lives in Wisconsin. Did you know? Um, and this is from Liz. Now, this one I did open and look at. I toasted. Um, so, Liz has a shop on Etsy. And she makes bun forms. But this ain't your mama's bun form. Oh, BT Doves. I will put Liz's link down here because you guys are going to want these. Trust. Um, she also has her shop name on a magnet for my fridge. So, I'll never forget. Very smart marketing, Liz. So, um, any hoodles, like I was saying, Liz makes bun forms herself. They're pretty fabulous. Um, not only did she absolutely match my hair color, which is nice, because, you know, my other bun forms are this, uh, like, scrubby stuff. I mean, and it's really light blonde, but it, it doesn't match. But it's good enough, right? Um, so, Liz... I'm guessing this is knit because this doesn't look like crochet. I'm going to guess knit. Look at how beautiful. Look, it's the same color as my hair. Um, that is a fabulous bun form. And because it is knit, you can still put pins in it. And it's just so much neater. And it's not, you see what's happening to this one, how it's getting, I'm getting these things that I need to trim off um, just from putting the pins and stuff. This is not going to do that. Isn't that fabulous? I will be contacting Liz soon um, with the dimensions for a really big bun form because I want a really big one. Um, this one will be great for half ups, half ups and like my standard sock bun. So cute. So yes, Liz's shop is down here because this is something we need. This is something we need. You guys know I love a sock bun. It is so easy to have a nice, clean, neat, professional looking hairstyle really fast. So yes. Thank you, Liz. That is awesome. And hopefully you will get some business and some of my other girls will buy some of these. And I will be contacting you probably within the next two weeks with dimensions because I want a big one. <laughs> oh, it's so nice. You guys, I cannot knit or crochet at all. I can crochet like one long line but when it comes to like attaching the second line, it's, it's beyond me. I am very good. Um, okay. I'm kind of good at a lot of things. That is not one of them. So all of you out there that can crochet or knit, that is like a magic power to me. Like it's magic because I cannot do it. I'm, I don't know. I did not get that gene. Both of my grandmas are fabulous at crocheting. Not me. They both tried to teach me. It's very sad. Okay. Do, do, do. Next. From Miss April. Hi, April. I talk to you on Facebook a lot. Um, oh, April is in Indiana. Um, Miss April also crochets. I think this, this looks like crochet to me. Um, she made me, look how cute these are. Um, I do believe... I'm not sure, does Miss April have an Etsy shop? I've seen some of her creations. Um, I don't think she does. We should make her get one. Um, but she can do like those, the, the, the toboggans, or if you're one of my Canadian girls, the toques with the beards and such. And she does like little girl clothes and I've yet to find anything she can't make. Um, she made me look, these are these little clippy, bows and she did these little flowers look look at the cuteness please focus camera um these are so adorable i mean so flipping adorable i love these things you did team um she also made me a couple of headbands and they have the little elastic in the back um a pink one and look at that flower with the sparkles. How flipping cute is that? And a turquoise one. 
My favorite color. My two favorite colors are turquoise and pink. Hmm. April apparently has been paying attention. Or she just took a really good guess. <laughs> I'm not sure, but these are so cute and cool because they don't hurt. I wore one the other day. They don't hurt me right here like so many of the headbands do. So um, I don't know. I might actually try and figure out a hairstyle to use headbands since I actually have some now. Yay. Thank you, April. Um, all right. And I have not opened these. Please do not bend. Well, they didn't bend. You'll be happy to know. I don't know who this is from. I just have a P.O. box in, is that Colorado? Westcliff, Colorado? Huh. I don't know what this is. I don't want to damage anything in there. Let us see. Yeah. Yeah. Hopefully I won't jab myself in the face with this knife. Okay. At least I got that open neatly. Ding, ding, ding. Okay, yellow is my favorite color, especially with red. Okie dokie. Oh, this is another Elizabeth. Um, one of my nieces is named Elizabeth. It's a good name. Um, she sent me envelope. Um, let me see. Oh, and down here. Okay, what do we have in here? <laughs> So she sent me some pictures and hilariously she has this. This was, um, if you remember when uh, I did the hubby tag of when I met my husband and I sat on his lap to get him to notice me, um, she remembered. Look how cute. That's so pretty. I think I might frame that. <laughs> That's really pretty. And she sent me um, a picture of her daughter as the Cheshire Cat and her her daughter's friend dressed as the White Queen. Now, look at these fabulous outfits. And that is a really smart way to do a Cheshire Cat. I mean, it really is. And God, I want this skirt. I love ruffles. Isn't that cute? See, Halloween time. You don't have to be absolutely literal. That was so cool. Thank you so much, Elizabeth. Um, I'm sure I edited there while I read. <laughs> uh, sorry about that. Um, and finally, I have a giant heavy box. I have no idea what's in this one. Um, oof. It's from Marianelle, or Ginny, um, in California. Oof. It is a big old box. Mm -mm. I think I need to have my husband sharpen my knife. It's not very good. Oh, I see all kinds of letters. Do I have to read this? Oh my gosh, there is so much stuff in here. You guys, it's like a care package. It's a care package. How sweet is that? Oh, what are these? These look, oh, it's chocolate. Chocolate. Look at, isn't this the prettiest little box of chocolates you've ever seen? Look at that. Oh, oh, so cute. Uh, what else do we get? Oh, a dog toy. Oh, my God. <laughs> Let's see if Murphy comes. <laughs> <laughs> what is it, Murphy? What is it? Jump. <laughs> Jump. <laughs> Come on. He's not going to jump. Um, I'll let him have that in a minute. He can't have it right now. Or maybe I should let you have it. It is so cute. Okay, I'm going to take this sticker off so you don't eat it. And I'm going to take these off so you don't eat them. You want it? Ah, ah. Yay! Whoops, you stepped on Buddhist, Murphy. You're so mean. So Murphy enjoys that. I have a little gold box. Uh, oh, it's so cool. Oh, my goodness. It's a dragon necklace. It's so pretty. Look, look. 
Look, ooh, and a red stone. So nice. Look, can you see it? Put my hand up. So pretty. I got jewelry. You know, my husband doesn't really buy me jewelry. I usually buy my own. Mm -hmm. Let's see what else is in here. We have Superberry Soft Superfood Dog Treats. Oh, my dogs are going to be so spoiled. Doggy treats. Oh, I said the T-R-E-A-T -E word. Somebody's here. Hi. Um, <laughs> what do we got? Oh, my gosh. How cool is that? So, apparently, Jelly Belly came out with Villains Mixed. We have Evil Apple mix and Lost Souls Mixed. Look at this. It's Maleficent and Ursula. That is so cool. Uh, Maleficent is my favorite. Um, we also have... Oh, my God. It's glitter. It's just glitter. Fairy Magic. Fairy Dust. Look at it. Look at it. Pink glitter. It's a bottle of beautiful glitter. You know I'm going to put this stuff on my nails or something. Okay, what else? What else? Oh, oh. What was another squeaky toy? Oh, it's so exciting. You're not getting that one yet. You bust squeakers. Oh, we have more Disney villains. Let's see. Captain Hook treasure chest mix and Cruella. Yep. Da -da 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 Awesome. Jelly beans. This looks like fancy coffee. This is fancy coffee. Fancy coffee. It is hazelnut cream. Mm. There is currently no hazelnut in my coffee cupboard. So, yes. You apparently have been in my kitchen lately. We ran out of hazelnut. Hmm. And let's, oh my gosh. Girardelli brownie mix. <laughs> my husband loves you. Um, we have one caramel turtle and one dark chocolate. Okay, the dark chocolate's for me. Caramel turtle, more my husband's speed. He will love you because I have to make these. Girardelli, I didn't even know Girardelli made these. That's crazy. Girardelli is the chocolate I buy when I do my uh, Christmas stuff. What are these? Aw, look, puppy chew bones, puppy chew bones. And, and at the bottom, oh, sparkly, it's Aurora. Oh, oh, it's Aurora. You guys want to hear a story about Aurora? So, when my youngest brother, who is now 27 years old, when he was little, um, we watched um, Sleeping Beauty, um, which is one of my favorite of the Disney uh, cartoons. I really like the style that it was drawn in. I think it's beautiful and looks like a painting, which I think was the point. Um, so yeah, so we're watching La 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 and my my baby brother turns to me and went, Sissy, you look just like Princess Aurora. Hmm. Uh, and that's why no matter how weird he sometimes gets, I love him anyway. <laughs> <laughs> he was such a little ego stroker without knowing what he was doing. Alrighty, guys. Um, I'm gonna. <laughs> Murphy really likes his toy. Um, I am going to read everything and start replying back because that is what I need to do. I have so many letters to reply to, and I want to read my whole stack of letters because I love it. I love getting to know you guys. It is so awesome. What are you doing, sweet monster? I'm going to take it. I'm going to take it. It's my, oh my gosh. Do you see? This is why he's a Boston terror. What was that? Five minutes? Come here, Murphy. Come here. I see you. Get out of the chocolate. Now, you're not allowed to have chocolate. Come here. Murphy. Stop dancing around. What am I up against? Come here. Come here, Murphy. Oh, oh gosh. You weigh a freaking ton. Oh, there's Murphy. Look, he's alert. Do you want it? Do you want it? So, needless to say, this is a big hit. Look, look at the camera. Say hi. <laughs> fine, fine, fine. Go get it. 
sorry. So that was 20 minutes of opening stuff and talking. Um, hopefully I'll edit some stuff out there so it doesn't take forever. But um, thank you guys so much. I love you guys. I am so lucky to have you. And aren't you proud I didn't cry today? I almost always cry when I'm opening the mail. I'm sure once I start reading the letters, it'll start. I just, yeah. I'm emotional. I'm like an emo teenager sometimes. So any hoodles, that is it. And uh, I will see you tomorrow. I do not know what our topic is yet. I'm kind of winging it. Could you tell? <laughs> All right, guys. I love you. Have a great day. Bye.